All right, hey everyone. We've got the Wazoo Survival Bushcraft Fire Starter Necklace here today. This is a leather and uh, fire steel necklace that you can carry anywhere with you. And this is just gonna be a tip or trick on it. So this fire steel is actually used, but as you can tell, I only decided to scrape one side. So it comes with a coating on it. So if you wanna make it look good when you still wear it, scrape the other side. And as you can tell, it's been scraped here and you can wipe off the ceramic scraper there. Here we have our scratches. So I've scratched the center line here and I'm gonna show you the tips and tricks to start a quick fire with it. All right, first things first is you're gonna to need to gather up your tinder. And for tinder today, to get it started, we're gonna either use a lot of fine grass or I was lucky enough to find a piece of a fat lighter or lighter wood out here in this pine forest. We've got a block here to make it easier and I'm gonna show you the tips and tricks. So first off, you're gonna need a knife or a sharp rock you find and we're gonna try and make a quarter size pile of tinder that's small enough to catch a flame. So here we go. I'm going to make one with this knife right here. All right, remember it's going to be really sticky for this stuff. So we're going to compile it into a pile here. And when we put it into a pile, the trick is we don't want any holes in the pile. We kind of want it to be somewhat solid where if we do get a spark, there's a greater chance of it catching. Use your body to block the wind. I'm sure you can hear there's a little bit of a slight breeze today in the camera, but use your body to block the wind. And if you can find a hard spot or a flat piece of a stick to put it on, this will make it much easier since it's such a small thing. All right, once we have this prepped together into a nice pile, that's a little bit larger than a quarter, but it should be a little more compact than that. Take your knife and lay it to the side and using your piece of wood or small stick you have left over, make yourself a secondary shelf beside your, your where you're gonna make your fire. This will give you a great area to rest your fire steel on as you try and throw a spark. So we're gonna try and get this in a couple tries. I'm gonna place my fire steel just like this since it's so small, I'm using the leather to help hold it. I'm gonna place it right here on this edge of the, of the piece of lighter wood, and we're gonna try and throw the spark down the side into the pile of shavings. So we will adjust if necessary. All right, using a firm grip, here we go. I'm gonna try and throw a spark in there. There's a couple good sparks. Looks like I missed the spot. Up, oh, we almost had her. We messed our pile up a little bit, so just readjust. And the wind got that one. We're going to keep throwing sparks to see if we can get it to catch. All right, as always, I didn't get it right on the first try, so we're going to readjust. There we go, the wind died on us and helped me out a little bit. Perfect, well that was a good real life situation. You never get it right on the first try, but don't give up. Now we've got fire and we could continue to build this up and we would be warm for the night. So you guys be sure to check these out, Wazoo Survival Gear. They're about $24, they're available on Amazon and directly from Wazoo. And y'all be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. I'll put some links in the description. Have a great one.